hello guys welcome to another short tutorial on angular in this video i am going to show you how we can make form elements read only it is useful when there might be some of the scenarios where we need to make some of the form elements like input field date input field drop down options or some other elements which we need to make it read only to the users based on some of the status or in any other requirements so let's see how we can make that one in angular Currently I have a component in which I have a title make form read only. Let me add some of the form elements here text input field. First element which I have added is simple input field. Next I am going to add a button. Next I will add a drop down option. Now we have four drop down options. Let me add file upload type as well. For that one we need to have input type is equals to file. Similarly we can have input type of the type date so that we can see how we can disable date type of input as well. Now we have different type of input fields or form elements. Save the file and view in the browser you can observe that we have simple input text field then a button and a drop down option and a file upload button and finally we have a date picker currently all these are input fields and there is no restrictions for these fields user can enter any data to make these fields as read only for the simple text type we can add read only angular attribute here and make this one as true save this one and if you come back to the browser and if you try to click or type anything in this input field you can see now it's read only similarly if you want to make button disabled or read only for this one you need to use the attribute disabled is equals to true save this one and come back to browser you can see button is grayed out now and if you click on that one it won't work for the next type that is drop down option disable work for drop down option as well and similarly for file upload type also disable works you can copy and paste that one for date input field you can use read only so that that will become read only field save this file and go back to browser now you can see all fields are now read only I cannot click on button I cannot choose any option in the drop down and similarly file upload is also read only or that is disabled similarly date picker is also not working so this is how we can make elements as read only this is useful in some of the scenarios where you want to make these fields read only or disabled based on some of the status for example if I want to make these fields based on some of the status for example I have a status where I will define as completed and based on this status I need to make these fields as read only at that condition what you can do is you can have another variable that is disabled value by default choose this one as false and define this one in all the form elements instead of directly putting true value within these read only and disabled fields paste this one here so now we are making this read only or disabled field as dynamic one so based on the status of this disabled value these fields will get enabled and disabled so currently I have mentioned this disabled value as false so if I save this one and go back to browser you can see these are editable if I make this one as true save it and come back to browser you can see all fields are disabled we can change this value based on particular conditions or criteria for in this example if the status is true if the status is completed I want to make these fields as disabled in that condition I can make this field value disabled value as true else this dot disabled value is false so as we can see your status is completed now so this form fields will be disabled so this is very useful when you are fetching lot of data from database and for particular user if they have completed any training or if there is any particular action item which has completed which you are fetching here by using dotnet web api 
in those cases you can make these fields disabled or read only and if the status is not completed which means it is in progress or in any other status you can make these fields as enabled so that user can edit those fields in that kind of scenarios this is a very useful feature which we can see in angular thank you guys for watching this video if you like this video please click on like button share it to others and subscribe to my channel